Hello and what is up my Atlanteans? How are you? For today's video, we have something super epic and super special to unbox today. As you can see right in front of me, we have Jade Hunter from Rainbow High. Oh my gosh, you guys, she was so hard to find. I was really, really hoping to get her for like Black Friday or Cyber Monday, but she was sold out everywhere. No one had her. So when I went to the store the other day and I saw her on the shelves, I absolutely had to get her. And now I have her and she's so super cute and I'm so excited to get her out of the box. Just like the other girls, her box is exactly the same. We have series one, Jade Hunter on the top here, and then it says collect the rainbow, which is also their hashtag. Hashtag collect the rainbow. And then right underneath that, we have the entire doll in all of her glory in her first outfit she's in this test tube shaped box and then on the bottom here we have the pictures of the main six and that goes on to the back here you can see everyone that's in the first series so far we have skylar bradshaw sunny madison and ruby anderson and of course on the front Every doll comes with a second outfit and they are displayed right next to the doll in two separate boxes that are attached to the to the box here. Yay! She's so cute and she's so pretty. I'm so excited. So let's get her out of the box. Oh my gosh, I barely even got her out of the box and I'm already about to cry. She's so cute. And here she is with everything she comes with laid out around her. So first of all, let's talk about the accessories that she comes with. First of all, she comes with her, the usual Rainbow High hairbrush. This time we're getting all of her accessories in a neon lime green type of color. And then here is her green doll stand. We love that. Thank you, MGA. Last but not least, like any other Rainbow High doll, she comes with a coat hanger and pant hanger as well. And as a person who is a whore for a second outfit, we love having a place to leave them at. And before we look at the big doll, I want to look at her second outfit as well. The main reason why I like needed to get this girl is because she comes with Gucci shoes. I think that's awesome and I think that's so freaking amazing. And this is absolutely my favorite part of both of these outfits. I'm a slut for Gucci and these shoes are and they're so amazing and they're so detailed. Like, tell me this isn't a good enough reason to get this set. And then for her second outfit, she'd come in a track suit type of outfit she has a t-shirt here with in vinyl big vinyl black letters it says rh and then written across from it it says rainbow and then she comes with this track suit to go around it she has this lime green coat and track pants and i love the detail of how they put instead of the adidas logo with the adidas name on the top corner it says rainbow with a rainbow on it that is so cute i love the stripes that are all here on the side it's all stitched on and not printed on we love that and i was so excited to see that there was like a a little dangly label thingy <laughs> hanging from the pockets of the of the top part of the tracksuit and then looking at the main doll here, the beautiful, beautiful Billie Eilish inspired doll. A few things to note, she does have the same earrings as some of the other dolls in the Rainbow High line. Also, for the people who want to take off her beanie, it looks like it's really stitched onto her head. So let's get it out real quick. And as you can tell from how difficult that was, she does come with a lot of tabs stuck onto her head. Uh, to keep the beanie in place. I'm not mad about it. It's just, um, that was a lot of work. There are a lot of problems that people are talking about with the Rainbow High doll saying that their hair are super gelled up. Um, I can say that Jade's hair here isn't as bad as Skylar's hair for sure. It's a little gelled, but she can use a little wash and she'll be all good. So looking at her outfit, super cute. Her uh, shirt here says Anti-Sparkle Sparkle Club, which is definitely a reference to the Anti-Social Social Club. A normal t-shirt. It's just a straight t-shirt. And then she's wearing this green puffer jacket that is perfect for the vibe that she's going for. She's looking super laid back, super casual. We love that. And then she's full on wearing the Billy X Freak 
shorts, I think. Super cute. And there's even um, a drawstring for the pants. It doesn't look like that there's a Velcro on the back to get it off. It just looks like it's gonna be um, a stretchy type of pants, which we love, super accurate. And um, another thing about her shoes, I absolutely love these girl shoes, but they are the, I think they're Nike, the Nike shoes, the Nike sneakers. Um, instead of it saying air on each side or Nike or whatever on each side, it says rain, bow and what's super cool is that the soles or the platform part is see-through and you can see how the sh the shoe fits onto the doll you know that every one of their feet is like kind of pointed down but for the girls with the sneakers and the shoes they're wearing platform shoes and you can see how their foot fits into the platform part of the shoe here she is in her full glory oh my gosh i am absolutely in love with her the billy eilish vibes are immaculate i'm so excited to put her into the second outfit let's do it right now and here she is completely set up in her second outfit. Oh my gosh, in this tracksuit, are you kidding me? So as I said, with the shorts that she was wearing, it was um, kind of like a pull-up type of pant. Like um, there wasn't a Velcro on the back, so you kind of just like slipped it on. Same with these pants and it wasn't a problem at all. And it wasn't difficult to put in. Um, super loved it and I love the drawstrings here that is so cute like her hands I guess any rainbow doll hands I can say this about they will start off like super stiff like when I put them back in I was so scared I was gonna break them I just had to take them back out and just fiddle with them a little bit and then I slipped them back in and now they're moving completely fine the shoes will start off super stiff good thing that there is enough room in here to shove the foot in it will take a second to put them in but they got in completely fine and another thing about these clothes is that the amount of plastic that was stuffed inside of them absolutely unnecessary in my opinion i think we can reduce on the waist there other than that she's looking perfect her makeup is completely complementing her first and second outfit she looks great she looks so cute she looks perfect oh my gosh i'm so excited i swear the second outfits of these girls are my favorites every time and just like ruby i did want to see how her clothes looked like on the hangers the only reason why um i kind of wanted to test this out was because um specifically for Sunny, I think. When you put her into the second outfit and you try to hang up her first outfit, um, her pants don't, like she doesn't have a pair of pants. So she comes with just like a spare piece of this, I guess. But her first outfit, you will need all the pieces here. And I think that goes the same with Scarlett Bradshaw, um, but Ruby and so far Jade here, completely useful and we love it yay so that is everything for this video you guys i hope you guys liked it 10 out of 10 doll i highly recommend her especially if you're a billy eilish fan you're gonna love the nods and the little references the quality is 100 percent just be careful with the packaging there is a lot of little see-through tabs to cut through. I think if anything, um, I think the Rainbow High should cut back a little bit on the packaging. I mean, yes, it is great and it looks very luxurious, but um, we want to cut back on the paper wastage. But altogether, she is in the box pretty safely and she looks amazing in the box and out of the box. So either way, MGA, you're doing great and you're winning. I hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want. Tell me in the comments who your favorite from Rainbow High is. So far, I think Skylar still might be my favorite, but Jade here, she's just so cute. And the Gucci shoes are my favorite shoes, I think, in the entire collection. In the entire first series, let's say. Have a great day, you guys, and I'll see y'all on the flip side. Bye-bye.